Hello, I'm Steve. This is Bit of Munch. And I've got a microwave burger. Eggs Easy Diner, the big one, double decker. And this range has been out for a long time. It still says new on the pack, but it must have been out for a, oh, well over a year, probably getting on for a couple of years actually, but I've never tried one. I've heard really bad reviews about this range. That's one reason I've never tried them. Plus the price, they always seem to be expensive. But when I spotted this in Iceland for one pound, I thought, I've got to try it. I've just got to. And here it is. Here's, here's my big one. <laughs> or Ed's big one, shall we say. Yeah. It is, it is pretty big. What's the weight of this thing? 266 grams. It says two beef patties in a burger bun with a cheese slice and a sachet of burger sauce. Uh, the burgers themselves are 76% beef. Loads of other ingredients, of course. Loads of them. Um, and I say, you get your, your slice of uh, pl plastic processed cheese and your burger sauce. Right, it smells okay actually. It smells all right. It smells like a cheeseburger. It really does. So, let's see if I can pick this up and eat it without the whole thing falling apart. Here goes. Here goes with Ed's big one. Ah. <laughs> well, there's a good opportunity to try the sauce on its own. Because <laughs> it's squirted all over my finger. Oh, that's tangy. Very gherkiny sauce. Very gherkiny. Gherkiny burger sauce. And it's nice. It's nice sauce. The burger tasted all right, actually. Even though one of them seemed to spurt out. Let's attack it from a different angle. Hmm. You know what? That's not bad. That's not bad at all. The bur the patties themselves are pretty thick, and you can see they're meaty. the The feel in the mouth is meaty. It doesn't taste or feel like a cheap burger. It really doesn't. It's pretty well seasoned. You can taste the cheese. The bun hasn't dried out, which is great. It's still quite moist. For a pound, I think they're pretty good, pretty, d yeah, that is, that is good. Taken the top burger out. Let's try a bit on its own. Okay, it's got cheese and sauce attached, but let's give it a go. I'm impressed with that. I really am. Even though. I've got sauce and cheese and fat, <laughs> grease, whatever, all over my fingers. For a pound, I would have that again. I really would. Whether it's going to stay that price, or whether it's going to be discontinued, because quite often, as we all know, um, or you might know, 
Iceland, quite often when they're going to discontinue something, they'll reduce it to a silly price. And that is quite a silly price, really, for something like that. But if you see it for a pound, I recommend it. I really do. I like it. <laughs> and I didn't expect to. I'm wondering if they've changed the recipe from... Um, well, I, I saw quite a few reviews of this thing. They might have changed the recipe. I don't know. But my opinion seems to be quite different to <laughs> a lot of other people who reviewed it. But then we all taste things differently, don't we? What one person likes, another one doesn't. And vice versa. Right, I'm not going to get all deep and philosoph philosophical there. Philos yeah, that's something like that. Um, yeah, I've already said it all, I think. Get it for a pound. Right, I'm going to go and enjoy the rest of that. Uh, thanks for watching. Hit the like button if you've liked this video. And subscribe if you haven't done already. And I'll see you, you, in the next video.